Hi, welcome to my YouTube channel 3D Multimedia. So under the NLP series, today we will build question answering that is QA bot using transformers. So what is this transformers? Transformers refers to the transformers library developed by Hugging Face. This library provides easy to use interface to a wide variety of pre-trained transformers based models for NLP tasks. So we have some pre-trained models here like BERT, bidirectional encoder representation for transformers adopted by Google. We have GPT, generative pre-trained transformer adopted by OpenAI. We have Robert A, robustly optimized BERT approach adopted by Facebook AI. We have distilled BERT that is adopted by the hugging face. So what is this pre-trained model? So th these are the models that have been trained on large amount of text data to learn language representation. These models can then be fine-tuned or directly used for various NLP tasks such as text classification, named entity recognition or sentiment analysis. So for today's session, we will be using TAPAS that is nothing but table based pre-training for answering selection model developed by Google Research. So this TAPAS is nothing but it's a transformer based model specifically designed for table based question answering. So in table based question answering tasks, the objective is to answer questions by extracting information from structured tables. These tables consist of rows and columns where each cell contains data related to entities, attributes or connections. The task requires understanding the table's content and context to provide accurate answers to questions posed about the data within. So now let us install transformers library by using pip install transformers. Then let us import torch library by using import torch. So which is a popular open source machine learning li library adopted by Facebook AI research lab FAIR. Now let us install this torch scatter from the specific URL given here. So this torch scatter is a part of Python geometric library which is used for handling graph data efficiently. So once we have installed the torch scatter, let us import the pipeline from transformers library. And this particular pipeline allows you to easily use the pre-trained models for variety of NLP tasks. And actually the pipeline belongs to the hugging face transformers library. Now let us import pandas, which is a powerful data manipulation and analysis library in Python. And then let us import our model from Google slash tapas iPhone hyphen base iPhone fine tune iPhone WTQ okay and save it under model URL then let us take the pipeline function which has two more arguments let us give the task name as table question answering and give the model so let us save it under the QA variable okay so it will take some time to download okay so now let us read the CSV file into pandas data frame by using pd.read underscore csv here i have given the path of the data and the data i have choosed is top 100 richest people dot csv so to get this path let me click on this left hand side of this folder okay let me upload the file so i have the file here so i'm choosing this file and click open so this file will get uploaded to the drive for a temporary time so from here let me take this particular path copy it and paste it here so this is where you get the path okay so let us now read the csv file the columns inside the csv file will be of different data types for example let me uh, display the first 10 rows of data frame okay you can see here so there will be data like numerical data string data types so let us in common convert everything to to a string data type now all the fields inside this particular uh, table has been converted to a string data type once we have done now let us define a question to be answered so my query is who is ranked number 10 you can come here okay so at the at the 10th row i have jeff bezos so let me execute this question okay let me print this in print statement okay i have used the pipeline to answer the question okay so here i am using QA table equal to table. So it, it should take from this particular data from this table and the query should also be executed with an answer. So now you can see who is ranked number 10 is Jeff Bezos. That is what 
we have given it here and similarly i have one more question like which name is associated with the company tech founder of oracle and same thing i have assigned the table data to table and query to query and these are the two arguments of question answering function along with the answer so here the founder of the oracle is at the row 8 larry ellison so we are supposed to get the answer as larry ellison okay so similarly you can define more questions from this because it's a table answering bot okay so if you like this video don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel 3d multimedia thank you